Welcome back everyone, I'm the Depressed Dior, and this is Blood Bowl Chaos Edition. Alright, I got some bad news for people who've been looking forward to these. Um, I will probably, this cup I'm doing is gonna probably gonna be the last cup. Um, this is mainly due to partially technical reasons, and some just, well, it's, they, the AI is very predictable, I've been, and some of the matches have been kind of samey. Um, being goblins does have its limitations on how I can level up, but that's not really a big issue. It still would have played out much the same with any other team, it's just maybe with a little less fail. But um, I'm going to finish this cup up and call it done for the time being. I've also been having technical issues where it keeps crashing and so forth, so I'm just going to try to get this done as much as possible. Also, this i am kind of um, been working on some other Let's Plays, so this one's been falling behind. So if you see a break in videos, it's probably me making a video and trying to render it. It takes about six hours to render this stuff, and it takes even longer to upload. Well, not as long to upload. So, there you go. Our next match is going to be against these... Um, oh, I guess I this will be the last match, because uh, I did not realize that. Really? Oh, that's right. Okay, we are in the playoffs. Okay, never mind. I just said I was going to finish this cup up, so, well, this is the last match. So we're going up against an elf team, which we already know about. They're rather well developed, so let's just make this as fun as possible. Also, I'm really getting sick and tired of seeing the, uh, the uh, Norse pitch, which is why I add that to the list of reasons. Because it's really hard to say that the random number generator is not broken when I'm constantly getting the same pitch over and over again. But enough whining. Let's keep. Let's get this done with. Uh, for those who are wondering, my next strategy game will be Final Fantasy Tactics with the um, 1.3 uh, content patch. So if you guys want to see that, uh, feel free. Um, I will allow votes for deciding what character job classes I'm doing, and blah blah blah. Shameless plugging. All right, let's do this. Uh, to do 180,000. We want bribes. We want guns. Lots of guns. That. Yeah. They have two rerolls. That's probably the only good news. But they probably won't fail very many rolls. They have a lot of lodgers. And so forth. They also have catchers and throwers and all that fun. Wonderful, fantastic stuff. But since we're technically in second place, we should. Even if we lose, we will get some fame and all that stuff. But I want to at least try to win. But we are goblins. I'll keep this all one video, and hopefully, uh, I guess I'll be done with uh, Blood Bowl for this week. Watch this. This will be like the one game where I don't get the Norse pitch. But it's all I have yet to see any updates on this, or patches, I'm pretty sure it's not going to be the case. Yep. Hello, Norse pitch. Tails. Hi everybody! Yes, it's me, Kicking Tim off. Johnson, and my good friend and Blood Bowl legend, Bob Biffet, who will be bringing you today's game. It's gonna be another killer, Jim. I hope so, Bob. I hope so. There's little or no way out for this team. The players are gonna have to play out of wow, this Wow, my frame rate just is just still. dying. There we go. Oh yeah, GNN. Blocking guard. Did you hear about helmet tough as nails, wolf? 
the madly sadistic chainsaw swinging star. Oh, I mean, oh, he's still ready to hire us out. Hello. He's been siding lizard men's heads and scales as he always complains. Damage his chainsaw. All oh, thank God I made that. So there goes my reroll. game. Oh well. Whoa, frame rate. KO'd. That reminds me of when I took Griff to bits in the 91 final against Reitman. Oh yeah, you need Captain. make the pass to hit this catcher, I won't be able to really stop him. Oh, they're ganging up on my fanatic. And he still couldn't do anything with it. Oh, nice move. Perfect pass. And he made a handoff. But it was with a catcher you've already moved. back up. Oof. Remember the 
503 season, which saw the retirement of one of Blood Bowl's favorite killers, Nobla Blackwood, who after eight great seasons finally hung up his chainsaw. It locked off more heads than any other chainsaw in history, including a match. Jeez, just not getting anywhere with this. In one match. You have tackle, don't you? No, you do not. Okay. Right here, move right here. And you can two die block. You can hang out there. Nice dodge. You hang out there. Enter. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. Alright. It's in the pocket. Or should I say in the hands? Oh, that's right, he has nerves of steel, so surrounding him didn't do anything. Let's try his throw, uh, passing some turn. To look stupid there. He slipped him the ball. It's not looking good for the base. There's a catcher with nerves of steel, so. Hello, cheerleaders. Yes, he's a bride. I got their guys back. Concerning where, when, and how one can accept. We'll say they had chainsaw for an next drive. Signed last season, the clubs are not allowed to offer less than the going rate. The ball goes skywards and the match is up. They're getting reroll now. Neat. Really, we just had pretty awful luck in that uh, in that drive. The ball is in his hands. I mean, we didn't fail any rolls, it's just we couldn't take down the, uh, any of our players because of dodge and block. Hello. Poetry in motion. What we'd like to see more, more often. often. Just not much in the block dice, that's for sure. Alright. Well. You go there. You go there. Today's insight comes from Jaime Schnibb, coach and owner of the Goblin Lowdown Rats. Don't have any openings, so we'll just hang out here for a bit. Magazine, he said that Blood Bowl was like war. No winners. Uh, I, probably sh I probably should have put my block uh, guard guy on the open like that. Okay, getting up for my fanatic. Our turn. Yeah, look at these awesome rolls I'm making. Oh, really? I'm making it going for it. Why not? Doesn't look like he'll be getting back on his feet soon. He should be up before next. There we go. Badly hurt. Without his armor, that player could have been hurt. But it hurts. I can hear the scream. <laughs> you 
Freaking A. Oh, really? Hey, Double ones? <sighs> Screw this if game. I didn't know better, <laughs> I could have mistaken these for an Amazon team, Bob. Don't be silly, Why did I not? Oh, that's I right, because I lost my trolls. That's true, Wonderful. Bob. This job is a lot cheaper than a plastic surgeon. I don't know if he planned it, but it won't do him any harm in the looks department. one of them, but they have like a bazillion backup players, so it doesn't really matter. And that was just their plus one movement allowance guy. And don't forget children, don't try and do this at home. You're Remember, go for my troll. these are seasoned professionals. Well, one of them is anyway. Really? There's no place to lie down for oh, sleep. Because of the stupid After troll. Like that, he doesn't have any choice. Just look at the fans. They're now really you're going to go and pick up the ball. The majority of supporters reckon that the league should take measures to prevent the small minority of peaceful fans from watching Lame. the match They've got a point. If they don't want to join in the fun, yeah, they might get as well up. stay home and watch it on cable vision. For at least you got it. All right, that's everybody. And once again, the AI just thinks, "Oh, we'll just move our catchers all the way down the up the other field when we don't even have the ball." Blitzer's coming. I've heard of teams that should be disappeared. 
appeared to have been abandoned by the supporters. Let's say that some teams who haven't won a match for several years have been tied up by their fans and thrown into rubbish containers. All right, let's go ahead and score. Way to end the downward smile. All right, tie game. All right, I'm done. Um, what you just saw was me crashing. Uh, it ha seems to happen every time I... Uh, well, not every time, but it happens whenever I score a touchdown. And during the little, you know, cutscene where it pans out and I, and I click the skip it, it will either skip it or it'll just flat out crash. So um, I checked through, I did check the uh, the Fraps file, it took it, it wasn't corrupted, so you guys will get the C up to that point, and then that's it, I'm done. I'm, it's bad enough I have to deal with the random number generator that may or may not be working properly, but uh, I'm also apparently rolled it, rolling randomly every time I uh, score a touchdown that my game could crash, so yeah, that's part of the reason why I'm, that, that was going to be our last match anyway. So I apologize for the anticlimactic uh, end there, Just we'll just take it as a tie because I should have scored that touchdown. Well, actually I did score that touchdown, I just didn't... Didn't, it did not go on beyond that. Uh, we'll go ahead and take a quick look at what we have left. We'll take a look at our team roster, and this is who we have. Um, recent, our most recent recruit was Akira because both our bombardiers had, well, one of our bombardiers retired and another one got killed. Um, we only had, we, for a goblin team, it was very disappointing on the amount of like casualties we suffered. Like, we didn't suffer much of any. Uh, we had two deaths and a niggling injury, and that was it. We, and the rest of the replacements were just because I needed the... Either I didn't get the roles I want, uh, the skills I wanted, or I just needed to drop my uh, team value a little bit. So, overall, it wasn't too impressive. I will say, in consequence of, my first Pogoro was awesome at her job. Um, Anastasis was awesome, and my god, I've never done so well with big guys before. Uh, Cerno, Masaro, I've never I've never had a big guy go up to level 3 before, and some of them were pretty close to getting to level 4, I think. Were they? Yeah, they were pretty close, an MVP away, really. And they, they did their job. They got, they both got their guard, one of them got block. I mean, they definitely uh, held the ground for us. Unfortunately, they seem to get really stupid very often, because I roll 1s all the time. Um, besides that, uh, Juliana did really well, plus one agility. Uh, it really made up for the fact I kept rolling ones and twos when I picked up the ball. And then we had some blockers, which kind of helped, but not too special. Other than that, it's, that's about it. Um, the only time I got any benefit from the Bombardier was when I threw it in the middle of a bunch of guys and nearly killed them all. Um, we did actually rather well against a lot of the Bashir teams, uh, surprisingly enough. Um, so I'm pretty impressed with that. But uh, unfortunately, it just I don't know. It was very, I found the game kind of the uh, session a little lukewarm as far as injuries are concerned. I was expecting to get like destroyed, but it didn't happen. Then again, the AI is not particularly powerful. And even against the AI, a lot of times I didn't get much of the injuries. I mean, we got a lot of injuries, but they were all like badly hurts, nothing too special. So it was kind of uh, kind of dull. But uh, hopefully, you guys enjoyed it and got to see some fun. Um, I did do a throw goblin successfully once, which was pretty awesome. But, uh, like I said, I'm not going to deal with this anymore. I'm tired of crashing. I'm going to try another game. It'll be Final Fantasy Tactics, probably. Um, so, I apologize, but, uh, yeah, I'm going to go ahead and call this Let's Play done. I did say I was not going to probably finish it. I was just going to play until I got bored of it. And for the most part, I'm, we'll just say I got tired of the, uh, the, the bugs. And, uh, you know what? I'm tired of the stupid Norse bitch. I'll say it. I'm tired of it. I mean, even someone commented on it, like, on my last video, on the last match. Or, not the last match. Well, match before last, because the last match hasn't been uploaded yet. But um, they're like, yeah, it's same pitch. The only time I did not get that pitch was when I raged quit, and I got the, um, I think it was Lizard Man pitch, which was a lot more interesting. So, yeah, I'm done for now. Uh, hopefully, you get, like I said, I hope you guys enjoyed it at least. It was, I did do a lot of matches. I did about, this. if I had finished this game, it would have been four cups, so not too bad. And we won two of the cups, and this one we probably would have won, actually, because... I'm just going to say I would have won. <laughs> so, for those of you who were just here for the Blood Bowl, I understand if you want to cut out or not watch my videos, but um, stay around. I do do multiple uh, 
other strategy games. Um, like I said, it's going to be Final Fantasy Tactics. Um, I may take a look and see about some other um, strategy games. But I haven't really seen any that are either I'm willing to spend that uh, interest me or I'm willing to spend money on. But uh, there's always more indie games coming out, so I can always take a look at those. Anyway, I wasted enough of your guys' time. Sorry for not being able to do a full match, but the game Cyanide sucks. There you go, I said it. Anyway, I am the Depressed Dior. This was uh, Blood Bowl Chaos Edition with Team the Strongest. And here are our two trophies. See you guys in the next LP.